imagine being a Disney vlogger right now. <laughs> I, and I'm not talking about the, the average family. I'm, ta I'm talking about the, the influencers, the vloggers, right? The content creators, as it were. Imagine going to Disney World right now, okay? And imagine pulling out a camera, okay? And filming your experience, right? It's not even an original experience, right? Like, you're, fil you're filming the exact same food review as what? You, you are producing facsimile content, bitch. You imagine being so self-employed. So, okay, so if, to, a couple things. Not only are you at a theme park when, when, when you don't need to be, okay? It's not like you saved up for five years to take your family there. Bitch, you have a pass. You go every day. You go every, you go too many days. And then you pull out your camera and you vlog the same thing that everybody else is vlogging, right? And you monetize that vlog, right? Like you're making kashish off of that vlog, right? And disrupting everyone around you, uh, around you's experience, right? Like you're, please. If you've ever seen a vlogger in the wild or a live streamer in the wild, I can assure you, it just, it just you wanna talk about suspending disbelief, that will drop you right down to earth, bitch. On top of that, you haven't even acknowledged Jennifer Osite's exploits. <laughs> okay, Matt, I would, I, I, listen, I would have res more respect for you if you came out and said, hey, um, you know, I'm pro is not real, okay? It's, it's the lack of acknowledgement for me. And you're doing it inside of a simulation. You're gallivanting around the happiest place on earth, filming it, making money off of it, whilst not acknowledging. Okay. Like, are you not embarrassed? These people are not embarrassed. These people are literally showing off the newest lounge fly, whilst the children of watermelon are taking their last breaths in knock-off Minnie Mouse pajamas, okay? These people-